my question is that uh, how anyone can handle ego? Well, uh, this is a highly philosophical question <laughs> and you know, ego is aham, right? This is not a question that is limited to one culture, even though by all reckoning, we Indians have the highest ego per unit of achievement. <laughs> that's a reality, that's a reality. We always, you know, in everything, we say, Mera Bharat Mahan, this is the greatest cricketer in the world, this is the finest uh, scholar. We, we tend to use too many superlatives. I think the, the best way to overcome ego is to start giving the credit to the team and try and make the younger members of the team feel an inch taller in your presence. Make them feel that they are the owners of what has been achieved. This requires a lot of effort, a lot of proactive efforts. And once you start doing it, then that becomes the norm. Everybody will, it's the leader's responsibility to do it. And once the leader starts doing it, everybody else will start doing it. So these are all things that have to be learned hard, practiced hard. And they are not easy to, to give up, but once you put in a lot of effort, I think it should be possible. I will handle in a different way. What is to think great about us actually? You are like anyone. I have a brother who is a professor at Caltech and an astrophysicist. So I asked him once, you know, he, he, he did 50 papers on nature, nature or something. So I was very proud. I asked him, is it not great? He said, look, look at this. Look at the universe. There are many Milky Ways. There are many suns. And one of the sun, there are many planets. In one of the planets, there's Earth. In, in this Earth, there are many countries. In that country, there is a country known as India. In that country, there are many states. In that, Karnataka is one state. In Karnataka, there are many places, and Hubli, I belong to a place known as Hubli. Hubli is one town. In Hubli, there are many houses. I am, we are one of them. What's great about us? You tell me. <laughs> What's great about us? There are, if you think we have done something fantastic and great, then unnecessary you feel you get ego. If I'm very beautiful, please remember that the Ishwar. If I'm very rich, please remember that the Bill Gates. There, is always, there are always people above you and below you. You are normal. And given a set of circumstances, you have done something nice, it's fine. Much, much more than that, you should not take credit because really life is not worthy of fighting for ego. It's not really not worth it. Your lifespan is small and do something good, have fun, do legally, ethically right things and, and enjoy life. That's enough. Why I think I'm the superman? There is nobody superman. There is not a superwoman, there is nobody, if I am writing well, there are always people who are better than me. So you should never think that way, you are ultimate in life. There is nobody the ultimate in life. Life itself is ultimate. Okay, thank you. You know, the other day, I was coming from London, day before yesterday, and next to me was Karina Kapoor, was sitting in her seat. So many people came to her and they said hello. She didn't even bother to react. I was a little bit surprised. Whoever came to me, I stood up. They, we discussed for a minute or half a minute. That's all what they were expecting. But she must be a million admirers. She so must have been tired. As well. <laughs> that is not the issue. That is not the issue. The issue is... Murthy, the issue a founder is, and, a, and uh, a software person will have maybe 10,000, but film actress will get a million. Okay? No, 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 that is not the issue. The issue is when somebody shows affection, 
I think you can also show it back in however cryptic manner you can. I think that is very important. Anyway, it that, these are all the ways to reduce your ego, that's all. Anyway. I